Uh, well, he, yeah, he's had the AARP card for like 15 years. Come I, on. What is the AARP? The American Association of Retired People, or persons. persons. I can't remember which. Persons. Oh. Is that real? Yes, of course it's yeah. real. Why do you think there's discount Denny's? So I can retire staying at Art Park? No, no you have to be you 62 have to be, or something. You have to be 50. Uh, 50? I believe it's 50? between 50 and 55. I think it's 55. I, I remember my dad's had one for a while, and he's almost okay. 60. I'm getting so. close. I can smell that 20% off my moons over my hammy now. Well, you're the coupon well, king. Well, just go of there for your you birthday. It's actually you get gone a free down. One. You get a free moons over my hammy? You get a free something at Denny's on your birthday. Anything you want. I got a free bumpkin in the like bathroom once, but I, I don't think it was my birthday. <laughs> what? That's gross. I got a free bumpkin at Denny's one time. A bumpkin? Blumpkin. What's a blumpkin? <laughs> like you blump and you kin? What's yeah, a blumpkin? I'm not explaining it to you. Now's a great time to donate. <laughs> you blump your kin. That's what you're telling no. me. That's incest. I'll tell you off the air. The next break, I'll explain it to you. Just saying. <laughs> what? <laughs> blump cheese kin? Yeah, no, I know what he said. That's what he said. That's, that's well, what he said. Is there a difference between bumpkin and Can we get a mic just for the damn bell? Yeah. <laughs> you're gonna hurt yourself. Yeah, your, your head's gonna go. Gosh. Head okay, put on the mustache. Everybody's gotta wear the mustache once. Touch the hairy thing. It doesn't it matter where shilling. I wear it. It's a hair pillar. No, you can under, put it wherever you want. Make vagina. one big eyebrow. It's more fun that way. To do it as an eyebrow? Yeah. Like a unibrow? Yeah. I had the mustache on upside down yeah, earlier. Yeah, uh, that's good. Just, yeah. Just like there you go. Okay. <laughs> That's great. That's really That's good. good. You like look that. like you're mad. I'm mad? Yeah. Look, look. Oh, angry eyes. <laughs> angry eyes. If you don't donate some money to these people, I'm going to be very angry, and you wouldn't like me when I'm angry. <laughs> he clips mad coupons. Clip, I'll clip your coupons. <laughs> no coupons for you. What did you say in your thing this morning? You're like, I wonder if Jay goes around and has like scissors like stuck to his hand. Yeah, like Edward like, scissor hands. <laughs> if like the paper comes through, he's like, choo, 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 choo. I want this coupon. I want this coupon. When you, when you get good enough at couponing, uh, you don't need scissors anymore. Do you get paper cuts? No. No, it's usually like the fold. If you don't use scissors, what do you use? You strategically rip. You rip? Strategically rip. Do you do that rip. thing where you fold it over the counter? Like you take no, the no, no, you can, you can, you can. I mean, if you're good enough, I mean, depend, if it's coming from a newspaper, you're gonna fold the paper. Where else is there coupons? There's coupons everywhere. You can print. I print coupons out of uh, from websites. Have you ever used uh, coupons at a strip club? Um, <laughs> Just curious. I don't. Yes, to think about it. Well, you know, tip, in West Virginia once, yes, I did. Sometimes they give you scrip, which is kind of like a coupon. You know, like funny money. Like right. you have to buy funny money, so that's kind of scrip. Scrip. Okay. <laughs> scrip. Scrimp. Like she was you learned scrimping? a new word. She wants some scrimp in her pasta? No, scrimp. No, 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 no M. I was on the Gulf Coast and I wanted some scrimp. Scrimp. Scrimp, scrimp. toast, scrimp pasta, scrimp. Scrimp. Proud yeah. scrimp. What is scrimp? It's that's like, it's shrimp. It's a ghetto shrimp. Yeah. Really? It's a ghetto shrimp. When I was okay. growing up, my uh, my mom and dad used to call cigarettes scrimps. What? What? Yeah, no, seriously. So, really? so that, yeah. So that their parents wouldn't know what they were talking about. So they'd be, they'd they be sitting there casually. Shrimp? I have no idea. Let me finish the story. They'd be sitting there casually and be like, hey, do you want to go out for a scrimp? And my mother would be like, okay. And they'd leave and come back. So your grandparents just thought your, your parents were addicted to seafood. Basically. Okay. <laughs> okay. Which, you know, when you think about it, is actually more healthy. Than cigarettes? Yeah, some of it. What if it had like a, a poisonous sea disease in it? In That's, the scrimp. Was that going around lately? <laughs> poisonous yeah. sea disease? Uh, when was the last time it you heard about that? It was in the water. What's in the water? E. coli. No, it wasn't. It was bird No, poop. it was a seagull. It was a sea. It was oh, the way. seagull. Yeah. Seagull. Way, it a was seagull. It was fecal did. matter. Seagull fecal. Fecal. Right. <laughs> fecal. That's all it is. True. Fecal seagull. It's because a bird pooped in there that everybody got sick. Are you I see, is it, Nobody is got sick. Is that true? Is I've that heard true? of a lot of people actually... like had diarrhea and stuff. The That's normal did? for Portland. <laughs> so you're saying that people in Portland walk around with diarrhea? Everybody drinks MGD and Pabst. No chocolate, no rain. chocolate rain. I like to call diarrhea and chocolate rain. I like to have diarrhea and be like, oh, chocolate rain. Do you really? Are you, if, you're on, if you're in the bathroom and you're taking and a I poop and you're like. And I had the squirts, I'd be like, chocolate rain. Yeah, you're right, I would. I would sing the whole song. I'd be like, today's on day. You gave me chocolate rain today. So how's your new roommate? <laughs> he uh, plays the trumpet in the band we just heard. I know, but what's he think of living with you? He thinks I'm chocolate rain. Does he? Does he really? Yeah. He's, he's not. He's nowhere to be found right now. So you can say whatever. He's not. You want. Where is he? He's I, out having a scrimp. Oh, he's right there. Oh, is he? he's, he's not really paying attention because yeah. I don't think anybody games is. together. Oh, we got his well, attention nice. right there. Ask away. You won't find any dirt. Wait. Can, wait. What dirt on you? Can, no, no, come here. You no, can come, come on. Come on. 
can you stay there but let your ass come over? Is that okay? Yeah, you can you can just yeah, park your ass right here. Portland, this is my roommate. You're not even in the frame. There you go. There, perfect. Perfect. Oh. Careful. He was up to Charlie's butt earlier. How are you doing, Robert? I'm good. How are you? It's a Hanukkah miracle. So now you're you're living with Emily now. I am living with Emily now. How's that working out for you? Oh, it's working out pretty good. Yeah? No, 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 no. Oh, no. my unibrow fell off. Sure, she, sure. she said the other day. Unibrow radio. Oh. Unibrow radio. Yeah. Unibrow radio. Yeah. Nice. Nice. It's a beautiful thing. Dude. You know, you, know what, you smell really like some well kind of strange like Pringles or something. There you go. <laughs> According to Charlie, it's called B.O. Yeah, it's not B.O. Yeah. Who wants a mustache ride now? Yeah, baby. Go on. <laughs> oh. Oh, Burt Reynolds. <laughs> <laughs> looks like Burt Reynolds. Looks like Burt Reynolds. Can I have it back? Can I have it back? <laughs> Come on. Brian's going to wear it. This is your initiation we've been talking about. Nope, you got to go downstairs with it. <laughs> yeah. What, what? No, I'm not <laughs> in your everywhere face. Else. <laughs> oh. oh. That didn't last very long. Put it on your taint. Nipple his, sack. his young face has rejected <laughs> hair. <laughs> Actually, you got some growth going on today. I'm pretty impressed. Isn't that a Louis Armstrong song? Put it on your taint. Yeah. I, oh. A lot of horns. Put a lot of horns in that Did one. Did you say taint? In yes. a charity auction? You said taint. <laughs> There's no auction. What are taint. you selling? Taint. <laughs> the auction, I think, is much, much later. <laughs> no, we're just, this is all just <laughs> charity. charity. There's taint. no auction. Taints for charity. Yeah. For charity. This charity is tainted. <laughs> yes, it is. You know, if you look at this, tried. this is kind of weird. It's like, look at that. It's like you're with me. We're together. It's like whatever I can do, you can see on screen. I know. Looks like, it looks like an AA group. <laughs> it does. I know. <laughs> Hello, my name is Jay. <laughs> yes, I'm and see, like, the titles were just right down here. Look at the titles. <laughs> the t- <laughs> Can we get a new title that says There's no title there. Robert Roberts. Can we say Uniball Radio? Yeah, there right there. Oh, yeah, I just stabbed you. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm kicking Sabrina. Are your parents Are your parents watching? I really hope not. Really why? Are you embarrassed? I'm always embarrassed. Oh, really? You're one of those people. I'm just embarrassed for you. Oh. You're embarrassed for me. Sure. Yeah. You're always embarrassed. What are you, a Catholic? No, my dad is. Uh, I got that. No, you're a Gentile. <laughs> Video game, non-Gentile, be Gentile. What? You're Meshuggah. You're Mish- I don't know from this. Uh, you had a box of video games that you moved into our living, oh, living room, and it meant to say, video game console, be gentle, but it said, be Gentile. It said, be non-Jewish. <laughs> yeah, what was with that? That was really weird. Uh, I had to point that out. It was like, see, look, he does. it says, be gentle. And I'm like, That's not what it. it says. Yeah. He was like, do you know Intentional? What I'm retarded. That's about, as, about as far as it goes. I like them dumb. <laughs> I like them dumb. That's why he hired us. He's like, I don't get it. He's like, joke. I'm like, I don't get it. He's like, yeah. He's touching my cans. Have a beer. Can. Why don't you? Have a beer. He's my roommate. He can have one of my beers. I know. I'm just saying. I was being. Uh, I, I like the cigars in a there flourish. Too. You took one of his cokes, so he can take one of your beers. Yeah, it was a Mexican. Wait a minute. Are you 21? 23. Oh. Are you 21? Barely. I'm 18. I'm sorry. I like them young and dumb. Oh. <laughs> Wait, do you have a chocolate Willie? What, with me? What? No. What? Like I, have, I, was, I have half one in my pocket. I was asking Brian if you did, actually. Oh. I was uh, asking Brian. No, but yeah, I know you've got extra Kona Willie, so I'll borrow one. Ooh. I'll borrow it back after I'm done, I promise. Uh, no. Don't borrow one. We don't want it back. If somebody Why not? Wants it, uh, you want it back? Sure. Oh, my. But Target for tomorrow in the Horn of Destruction. Oh. No, seriously, though, if somebody was to donate $100 right now, would you eat Robert Wagner's weenie? What? Yeah, oh. if someone was to donate $100 right now, would you eat Robert Wagner's chocolate weenie? Oh, God. Half of it. Out. There's only half of it left. Oh. And it's been on the floor. It has real carpet hair on it. Well, as long as it doesn't have real pubic hair on no. it? No. Okay. No, no. Sure. Okay. But I was caught. I did not wash out the mold first. Just drink your beer. It's okay. <laughs> I think what we could do with Bar- with Brian is is actually instead of creating a chocolate weenie for him, is lay him face down, and make a make a, a chocolate. A uh, chocolate butt mold. Tunnel, yes. A we tunnel. Could and then we could reenact what's going to happen later with you two. Ew. What are you saying? <laughs> and chocolate. It looks like he's sitting on my lap. He is. Isn't that cute? It is nice. Are you sure your parents are watching? <laughs> You know, eventually this is going to be legal. Gay marriage? It's already legal, we're just not can't get married. Right. 
No, that's what I meant. You can fornicate all you want. Just go to Vermont. Fornicate? Who said For that? For syrup? For syrup. Maple? And Vermont cheddar cheese. And Ben and Jerry's. Are they from Vermont? And cows. Yes. Oh, and I fish. didn't know that. And fish. Fish? The band? The band of fish are from Vermont. And so is Gaga. Lady Gaga is not. She is. Where's she from? Wait a minute. Vermont. Yeah, you She's from New York. Vermont. Isn't She's she living Vermont. in uh, Berlin right now? Vermont. That's Peaches. That's Peaches. Oh, Peaches. Well, yeah, not Lady Gaga. I get it. Gaga. Oh, rah, rah. Hello. Rah, rah. Hello. Lady Who Gaga. That's uh, right. Oh, hello. <laughs> so, uh, are you guys performing anywhere else soon? Uh, we are performing at the Hawthorne Theater on the 30th. Naked? Uh, sure. Is that an all ages show? It is an all ages show. Okay. Cool. Naked. Naked. You can actually go, Jay. It's a naked all ages show. <laughs> it's an all ages show. Yeah. 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 18 and over. It's not 18 and over. Which one, uh, That's right. what I would like to call a montage. If you were all D- getting different naked. information, I'm getting different information. We've got to tell people about what's interesting on Twitter, the best fun on Twitter. Yeah, we'll get to that. Okay. Yeah. I was just we're reminding. Good. Do you guys play that game when you're like in your weird little house thing? I don't know if Brian knows about it. Does he? Hmm? The the cool Twitter game. You know the cool Twitter game. I do not know the cool Twitter game. Who are you? No. I'm Brian. Oh, hey. <laughs> you're on my lap. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of weird. <laughs> I need a lower third. <laughs> Never mind. Do you have any yeah. rusty trombones in your band? <laughs> <laughs> Presumably with lady friend, but is this man friend? She's not invited. No. Really? Who is? What? Oh. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Yeah. You guys ever perform in a sweat lodge? Would you like to? <laughs> I think I think it would work really well for the brass. Dude, his mustache. Oh, there it goes. It just fell off your leg. Mustache down. <laughs> mustache down. I need more beer. My beer needs a mustache. Anybody else need a beer? I'm I'm still. I just. Oh, Peter Stash. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Well, out of the 12 pack. My beer has a mustache. We're down to two beers. That's it. I've had eight. There's another like five four pack over here. A five four pack. A five four pack. It's a holiday four pack. It's an Emily eight pack. Which one? Oh, these. Of the right, big I one. know that. The tall boys. Who brought them? Me. He oh, did. okay. Oh, was that your backpack? That was in my backpack. That was cute. You had a backpack. I had costumes to change into. You were like the girl from the Mansfields that went as the girl from Kill Bill, Chinese school. Oh girl. my God! Don't yeah. even go there. No, don't even go there. <laughs> That's not good. No. Yeah. So, hopes, dreams, goals. I gotta know if you're my type. Um, I h- hope I'm not your type. I dream of a world in which I'm not your type. So why are you sitting on my lap? Well, because that was one of my goals. <laughs> to sit on my lap. Exactly. <laughs> well, if, if Robert was, if played. I'm losing something, this is mixed. Up. I'm a very confusing person. I guess. Why do you keep moving your butt back and forth against my knee? It's trying it's to the rhythm. He didn't good luck wipe, with that. Apparently, very good. Hey, Say what? He's been up there playing for a while. He's got a wipe. Yeah. <laughs> He can miss the spot. <laughs> There's a the turtle really? poking. Yeah. Well, here's a question. If Robert uh, needed a kidney and you found out that you were the same blood type, would you donate a kidney to him? Oh. Well, no, I'd steal his other kidney. Okay, well, then you'd have So you'd have a spare. Exactly. See, yeah, that's, that's young harsh. people today are thinking ahead. Yeah, yeah. They really are. Well, there's a market. So, there's, it's, there's a black market for kidneys, but, you know. I didn't even catch any of that. I was just drinking my beer. But we're white. <laughs> oh, Robert. Uh-huh. Uh, uh, wow. Okay, Where's the, you know? It's over there. All right. Oh, no, no, no. You could just blow your arm. No, your oh, other oh, arm oh. with your tattoo, you, your thing. Oh, you have a horn on your you arm. You have a horn That's on your thing. arm. You could just blow your arm. Oh, look at that. Yeah. yeah. Mommy Make it and bigger. Daddy, look out. Make it bigger. Oh, Make it bigger. Is that a coronet? <laughs> Flex. Flex. Come on, Flex. <laughs> oh. Whoopsies. Oh. Jeez. Did you splurge? What? What? Did you splurge over the trumpet? Splurge or splooge? <laughs> oh, yeah, splooge over the trumpet. <laughs> splurge. Splurge is like when you go, go all out for things, right? Yes. Um, so what you, you should do. You got one right. <laughs> yeah. What you should yeah. do, Brian, is start working out so that you actually do get a, a manly bicep. And when that happens, you can you can you know do this and it'll look like you're playing ska. 
What? Mm, 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 mm. Out of the armpit? Can you do that? I can do you this got? one. Do you have an instrument? Me? Yeah. Oh, it's not. <laughs> oh, I'm spilling beer all over myself. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Donations accepted. Hello, Australia. What time is it in Australia right now? Uh, it's a uh, Sunday morning. It's time good day. It's what? <laughs> time good day. No, I know that. But it's like time Sunday afternoon. Aren't they what? Oh God, they're ahead? a while. Where are you going? He has to go. Oh yeah, okay, bye. That way he can give us a break so we can. They're all gone. They're all gone. They're all, gone. They're all, they're all ready. gone now. Are you quite through? This is my instrument. Boy, I hope they empty out their spit valves. Ew. They probably will. It's my instrument. It's spit, spit valve time, fellas. Empty it. Can you play do something it. on do yours? Do it now. Make meat. Why does that guy have a spit valve on his guitar? It's a tip jar. <laughs> like a. Why are people spitting in his tip jar? Thank you. I have no idea. They're splooging in his tip jar. You know, it's right over there. Uh, if you need to take five and go over there and do that, that's fine. Did you just wow. burp? She pulled an Emily. Yeah. It's an influence, I tell ya. It's no, what? I'm, look, I'm pulling it's a an bad Emily. influence. What is? Emily. Oh, yeah, really? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> that is pulling an Emily. This is not our studio. We must be nice. We yeah. must be nice. We must be nice. People have to use that later. I know. I'm just saying, if you want to pull an Emily, you have to pull it right. You have to, you have to drink the proper amount of liquid to project the proper amount of air. <laughs> In scientific terms. Okay, All so it right. uh, looks like we're going to throw it to the band again and take a little break. Back to the band. Target for tomorrow. See you in a little bit.
we're talking for tomorrow on the Horns of Destruction again. We got another team for you right now.
much. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. Holy crap. Hey, we're on. Target for tomorrow. It doesn't get much better than that. It does not. No. It does not. Unless there were two of them. Like two exact the same bands that say exactly the same. Yeah, and some kind of weird quasi-stereo. We should make that happen. We could make that happen. Cloning. We could clone them. Cloning. Yeah. <laughs> they can do it with sheep, we can do it with Target for tomorrow. Hey, look, Charlie. With a nice butt. Yeah. Well, you yeah. know. So I'm so beyond Charlie. Really? I'm, I've moved beyond it. Really? Yeah. Just in, in the past 15 minutes? Yep. How's that happen? Roma. I saw Roma. some guy in the back. I don't know. Yeah, whatever works. If he, if he and Charlie could like do like have Duke a fight to the death. Yeah, death match. That would be cool. Whoever's worthy lives. And no drumsticks. Like no. Brave oh. Oh. Ouch. <laughs> That's Why not? It would be more interesting. <laughs> I know. So before we get going, before we continue, yeah. um, Sabrina Miller, Jay Mackin, Emily Gibson, Robert Wager, just wanted to take a moment and recognize some of the fine folks that put this together. Absolutely. Uh, most notably, one of the, the, the brain, the brains. The brains. Behind all the technical stuff that's going on, just wanted to thank Doc Normal. Absolutely. For all thank the great you. technical stuff he's doing. He's working really hard back there. And, Everybody you know. applause now. Applause. Yes. Applause. Yay. For Doc Normal. Hey, Doc Normal. Thank you. Thank you very much. Technically, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> thank, thank you, Doc Normal. Yes. Uh, very good. That's you have a little bit of drool right there. That's not, that's not drool. What that's if, gratitude, my home country. Sputum. Really? I think more. that's just PBR. <laughs> Missouri. You ever done that? You ever gone to the doctor and the guy goes, the doctor says, what color is your sputum? You know, you're coughing, you have some kind of throat thing. What color is your sputum? I don't know. Do you, do you ever tell him? What's your sputum? <laughs> what color is your sputum? <laughs> have, has, no one's ever asked you that? Like your mucus? Yeah. That, well, actually, somebody used that on me as a pickup line on a bar once. And had a, he might have been a doctor. Was it Charlie? No. No? Oh. <laughs> I left that bar immediately. Yeah? Because I had no sputum. Was it a bar around here? I think it was in West Virginia. It was a swinger club. Okay, well, that makes club. sense. All right, anyway, back sense. to Are you starting to get drunk? Is that what's going on? No. No, oh, okay. no we can drink, but we can't get drunk. That's the rules. I see. Yeah. I see. Oh. Yeah. Whoops. Yeah. Well, there goes the after hours party. No, the after hours party is not for another day. This is an after hours party. We well, are yeah, technically hours. it is, yes. 24 hours from now. But it's 24 hours from yes. now. Yeah, almost, because yeah. I think uh, it would be 24 hours at, uh, at 10 o'clock. Right. Right, so we're almost 24. PM tomorrow, tomorrow or AM tomorrow? PM, PM, PM tomorrow. Yeah. tomorrow. Yeah. We're at okay. the front end of this. There, there's yeah. so much more. This is like an entertainment cavalcade of entertainment. Yes. You're not, you're going to have so much entertainment. You don't need, just stay tuned and just yeah. donate, you're like a, you know, go like a gerbil to the food bar. I can't even imagine putting this together. 24 hours. I know. 30 hours. 30 hours. 24 more hours. 24, 24 more. more hours. We're only not even six hours into it. Six hours was hard enough to put together. Can you imagine 30 hours? How would you know? You haven't been here for six hours. No, Dude, planning bacon, bacon fest, fest together. was about six yeah, hours. About six hours. You that was like three months six... yeah. for six hours. Yeah. Can you imagine planning 30 hours? This is less time, more stuff, yeah. more, definitely more technical stuff. Oh, yeah. Who else do we have to thank? What? You, God. You thank Dr. Doctor. God. I think everybody, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I thought, I thought there were, there were well, going to be some we got to thank Cami Chaos and yeah. Rick Terosi for inviting us here. Sure. And uh, for all of the really rad volunteers that are here and everybody just kind of making this possible and it's really cool. And of course, all of the, the people that are donating their money to charity right now for Toys for Tots and uh, Free Geek. Definitely. Oregon Food Bank. Absolutely. Yeah, all fun and games, but that's what it's all about. Like that's just truly raising money is, is, is raising the money for it. And what a creative way to do it, too, yeah. I think. Yeah. So kudos to you guys. Thank you very much for having us and for putting this on. I think it's a really, really great, uh, really great benefit that, you, that everybody's doing and participating in, and I couldn't be uh, prouder to be involved in it. And next year, 50-hour day. Oh, don't even go there. <laughs> that's two hours in two days. I'm sure Cammy probably just fainted somewhere. No. Very good. I like to consider myself a mathematician. She's like a you're rain like man talking from into Georgian. your boob, Emily. <laughs> Georgian huh? Rayman. So like every every mic. time that you talk, you're like talking right into your boob right here. I like to communicate with it. She's very conscious of where the mic is. I, yeah, she it's is. It's kind of yes. strange. Which Little is boob. weird because yeah. Which, yeah. Is, which is good because. Well, I it, have is good. it is a good thing. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. yeah. It is because that way it's picked up. Dear I want to make sure the viewers hear me. Dear boob. Guess what happens to hear you? No, the viewers. Oh, the viewers, right. The listeners. Yeah. 
the donators. Yeah. Very good. That's an interesting hat combo you have going on. <laughs> um, Very Christmassy. Part, part Jay, part Emily. Very Christmassy. It's Gemily. <laughs> <laughs> That's the New right. York show. We'll, well do a show, Gemily. This is kind of on the lowdown. Or Emily. I, I may discuss this here. Right? Yeah. If uh, Jay, not Jay, sorry, Paul and the DPJ were to, co- to hook up, it'd be D Paul. Right, oh, jokes. okay. That's great. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Jay's like, well, I don't get it. What? Uh, yeah, if I have no, yeah, he had yeah. no clue. Long story. <laughs> I'm getting drunk. When, when you get people locked up in a small room day in, day out. Yeah, this is what hours, you get, people. This is, what you, this is truly what you get when over you and over lock again. people in Life is just yeah. one long in joke. Yeah. yeah, it really is. Dender Sheeps, it sure is, you know. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> See? Well, can See, somebody tell a story, right? please? Yeah. The Dunder Sheeps? The story of Dunder Sheeps? Mm-hmm. Yeah, we probably should because. Why don't you, why don't you go yeah, ahead? Why don't you tell us the you story of Dunder Sheeps? Yes. All right, well, uh, one day I sent out a tweet and I said, Dirty Deeds, Dunder Sheep. And uh, we have a man who does a hiking show. His name is Alex Head, like Head you receive in a, a mobile vehicle. <laughs> and uh, he, <laughs> he decided that once he saw my tweet, that he was going to uh, tweet me back and be like, Oh my God, that's what it says. For my entire life, I thought that Dirty Deeds, Dunder Cheap was, in fact, Dunder Chiefs. Like a tribe of chiefs under the Dunder Code. <laughs> and um, it's not what it was. So every time we see Alex, we call him, we say, Dunder Chiefs. And that's not what it is. It's Dunder Cheap. ACD fans will know this. ACDC fans. ACD fans. ACDC ACD. fans. Yes, they would. Yeah. Right. And so basically, uh, somebody has created a Twitter account on Twitter called Dunder Chiefs. What? Continue. I, yeah, it's it's somebody in this couch, <laughs> in, not being myself. Wait, a minute. I wait I, I, yeah, we're trying to figure out who it is. Yeah. Honestly, we, I I don't have no idea. My who bets it is. are on Sabrina Miller. What? Yeah. No, yeah. it is not me. Because yeah. why would I tweet myself first? Because it was like, oh to yeah, girl, out. your avatar is the bomb. You got the swords and the leather, and it's hot. I could be Seriously, your baby daddy. Seriously, I can't even talk like that. Why would I even want to set up a Twitter because account and do that? Because like that. What? Split personalities. I, you know, my personality is like right here. It doesn't go anywhere else. It's the ultimate prank on me, and I'm going to figure out who it is. It's the ultimate prank on yourself? It is. Somebody is pranking me. They know that maybe it's you. Prank, prank Twitter just isn't fun. It's not me. <laughs> Somebody it's could get hurt. Me. Maybe it's Ashton Kutcher. You done been punked. Yeah, well, that oh. could be it. No. Because maybe I, I'm it's small time. Uh, maybe you don't, you don't punk small timers. Maybe it's Daniel Baldwin. <laughs> no, it's Sabrina Miller. It is not Sabrina Miller. Or Robert Wagner, or Jay Mackin, oh, or Douglas Sanger, possibly I, Diana Page Jordan. I didn't even know. <laughs> I, I really doubt that. I didn't even know the Dunder Chief story. I, I well, didn't we don't know. That's what I would say if I created yeah. the account as well. What Dunder Chief? <laughs> yeah, you just feign ignorance. Yeah. No. That's, oh that's it's like Clue. It's a game of that. Clue. It was Professor Balderdash in the study with us. Seriously, are you wearing pants under that? Yeah. It really? really doesn't look like it, Jay. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's kind of creeping me out. That's oh, okay. really weird. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. What if we lifted wait, wait. it up and saw a man like a Who looks? Who, who peels it back and looks? <laughs> then we would raise a lot of money the for charity. Two ladies on the couch. <laughs> it reminds me of a story of a man wearing a kilt. Oh. Hmm. Scott Cranmore? No. Oh. <laughs> Another guy. Have you ever worn a kilt? I have a kilt. You have a kilt? I have a, I'm Irish. A real one? Oh, okay. Or a yeah, okay. one? I have a kilt. No, well, it's from, uh, <laughs> it's from the, bre- the uh, brewery over here. That's um, real enough. Okay. Well, they say like girls wear skirts, like cause it's breezy, right? Do, do the men? I don't know if this is off topic, but do the men get the breeze on the, like the, you know, on the, the man bits? Yeah. You can wear undergarments with a kilt. Yeah, but I mean, it's at the point of wearing a kilt so that you can also feel the breeze. Do they go commando with the kilt? No. That's kind of the I point know. of the kilt. It's, no. If you're if you're a true Scotsman, but he says no. you, will, you will go commando with the kilt. Okay. Yeah. So, really? Yeah. That's oh, what that, that. yeah, no, that's like a typical thing that if you have a kilt, you ain't got well, nothing covering your I mean you got something covering your bits, but you ain't got nothing holding it. Nothing in. covering the kibble. Yeah, no, you know, no. The so kibble Sean is Connery. Out of yeah, the kibble is out of its bits or whatever. I mean, it's like it's there's nothing there. That's like the tradition when you wear a kilt, you're not supposed to wear anything underneath it. Oh god, I'm so I, glad I, I'm I CJ's or he's nodding his head. He's <laughs> he's in agreement. Yeah. You're well, Irish, I'm you know, Irish. I mean, you know, I, Scottish. I know, I know of kilting. How yes. much Irish are you? Um, my liver is at least, I know at least my liver is Irish. You no, can I, drink. Uh, yeah, I can drink. Yeah. Well, um, I mean, Mackin is a very Irish name, so I, it's... Tr- well, I'm so is Irish. Murphy. 
Yeah. Yeah. So is Gibson. Gibson. What's your point? Gibson's a German. I'm actually uh, Czechoslovakian. Are those glasses from the Britney Spears line? No, these are the Hannah Montana specials. Oh. No, no, no. He ripped them off from Mountain John. He already oh, explained it. Miley Cyrus. He already Cyrus. explained it. Come on. I know. I was trying to. Get oh, you to were that. trying. Thanks. Thanks. Oh, Miley okay. Cyrus. Thanks for thanks for fixing that. What about her? I'm Miley Cyrus. I'm pointing at you. She's <laughs> what a, what, that's, that's great. What she does. You would know. Yeah. She I, does. I, you've got she's some weird thing with Miley Cyrus. I don't know about you. I she was doing her weird hair thing. Is she above the age of 18? I was going to say, is she 18 yet? I have no idea. I don't think she is. I think she celebrated an 18th birthday because it was like a big hoo-ha or whatever. She quit the Twitter. She did quit the Twitter. Yeah, it was heartbreaking. Yeah. You didn't know that? No, but I heard she tried to get in a 21 and over drinking club and they denied her. (gasps) She said, Miley Cyrus and her friends are on the way. Do not let them in. Denied. And they showed up and they did not let them in. So she's under 21 but possibly above 18. Well, at least you can see the uh, horns. So of she could be 19. Horns she of Destruction, is that what it is? Yeah, the Hawthorne Theater. Yes. Yeah, the Target Hawthorne. for tomorrow, Horns of Destruction. You can go see that. If his Peter's going to be out, I'm definitely not going. What? Who's Peter? Brian's. He's talked about Dude. a nude show. I'm definitely not yeah, going. It's a nude show, but it's a special nude show. Yeah, but I do not want to see my roommate's Peter. Peter? Yeah, that's what I call Peter Johnson? It. Maybe it's a no. never, never nude show. Never nude. Uh, yeah, never no nude. nudity. Right. You, you're nude. probably right. Like Neverland? Never no, no, like never ever nude. Never nude. Yeah. yeah. Like it's where you wear cut off jean shorts but under your clothing because you never want to be nude. Oh, yeah, just like Tobias. Yes. Yes, see? Thank you. Thank you. Nice. Yeah, God, right I can't here, wait right for that here. movie. I can't come wait. Come on, come on, come on. Is that really official? I'm trying to oh, bump you. Oh, it's greenlit. It's greenlit. Really? I'm to bump you. I did not know that. Here, you know what? Fist bump on that one. Okay. Okay. You guys didn't have any weird moment over there? Yes, we did. Your weird arrested moment? We love arrested development. Yeah. It's just. What we I've never seen an arrested developer. You I'm have not. Take your shoe seen. off and throw it. <laughs> That's my shoe. <laughs> How dare you? I'll throw your hat. I don't care. You know what? If We're this even. was 3D Ooh. like Avatar, that would look really cool. Here's my sock too. <laughs> oh. oh Jesus, really? Oh. What are the, the okay? Here's na- now the auction begins. Now the auction begins. I'll give you three dollars if you put it away. It's worth it. Oh, right behind the couch. All right, well, somebody better be donating a dollar for that. So is your apartment? A dollar a sock. Come on. <laughs> a sock. We can get what? at least, what, two, four, six, eight. Come on, eight dollars. Yeah. Does your apartment need cleaned yet? Cleaned? Yes. Like, what do you mean? I mean, you've only been living there a couple of days, but... <laughs> Does it need clean? I mean, is it, like, messy already? Have you, you even met unpacked? Brian. Have you even unpacked? Well, we've unpacked, but my room is a mess because... I, should I tell the story? Have you guys heard the key story? Should I go into Well, yeah, I don't know. I know the Wait, key you had story. a key party? Yeah. No, I lost my keys and blah, 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 blah. Then I lost my spare set of keys and I got the keys back and I'm still keyless, but I went through my room the other night and literally everything that was on any shelf or anything, I just whoosh, whoosh, all over my room. So it's full of um, everything from iPod cords to bacon pops to peeps to tickets from Bacon Fest to Snuggies. To, to caution tape, I think is probably tape, somewhere in there. To video games to uh, sunflower seeds are all over peeps. my floor right now. Meat. Peeps. Peeps. Peeps, tons of peeps. I have about 60 boxes of peeps left, I would estimate. We should have brought some peeps and just said, you know, for a dollar, you get a box of peeps. Yeah, we should have. We yeah. have lots of That would be left. selling, not donating. Okay, well, we would donate the peeps. I don't know if we can legally we sell peeps. Them. OPD can we does don- it. Can we donate they the peeps? They sell peeps? No, OPD, you, you donate money to see uh, Splendid Tale. I don't know. What, what, what shows are on OPD lately? There's Monica, a jazz Monica, show. The, the, the jazz show. We can make show a puppet Gary, show out yeah. of peeps for money. <laughs> So, and then you, 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 know, you donate enough and you get a uh, reusable shopping bag or a tea set or, you know. Not peeps. Some, not, well, but what's the difference? What, really, what's the difference between, pe- you know, peeps and a tea set? Uh, one's useful, one's old Easter food. One's I think we should explain the peeps. Peeps Why? are, um, well, I've never actually had a peep before, but. Yes, you we, did. I, no, I hadn't before we ordered oh, okay. them for Bacon Fest and we were thinking about things that. We should order for the eating contest for uh, Bacon Fest. Peeps. And we decided on these horrible crude entrees, besides the BLT. The BLT was pretty normal. But we decided on the peeps, and we decided to put bacon salt on them. So my first peep experience, it was, I, I had half of one before that, but my first like true five peep experience was um, when I ate them at Bacon Fest, and they were covered yeah. in bacon salt. What are you doing? I'm just showing off my foot. This is a showgirl action here? Yes. And uh, during the uh, peeps at Bacon Fest, I was sitting next to Alex from Hike Yeah. This is the head guy that we mentioned earlier. <laughs> and uh, he was eating his peeps, and he looked at me, and he goes, Emily, I don't think I can finish. 
And I said, let me finish. I'm going to finish. I'll let you finish. Alex said, you can finish those peeps. And he finished them. Did he puke? And they were gross. You had a gag while you ate them. They were oh, yeah. marshmallows covered in uh, mesquite, like salt. Bacon salt. Which is like horrible. Oh, it was it's terrible. So Point of order. Here's a, science, here's a science trick for you to try at home with your peeps. Put two of them in a microwave for a minute, and they will go, they will grow. But like I don't want them to grow. They're hard enough to eat in a small form. You don't have to eat them. I'm just saying, you know, do a little... Like the dinosaurs you put in the water little and they experiment. I don't know. Yeah, like little like towels. Like sea monkeys? Yeah. 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 yeah, sea monkeys. You know, you could befriend your neighbors and pass them out to the, to the neighbors. Here's a giant piece. Nobody wants them. That's part of the problem. There's people, hundreds of them left. People in Southeast Portland will eat anything. To me, they are anything. valuable, though. I will not just give them away. I wonder if we could put it in with the Oregon Food Bank stuff. No. I think they're Aww. of value. No. They're like old Macs no. to me. Okay. I won't let you. That's why. No. <laughs> no. Don't give them the peeps. People want food of value. Food value. Not peeps. There's okay. no food value in peeps. I paid right. $12 for a case of peeps. And little little do you know, I got a, a free case of peeps with my peeps. But I did know. <laughs> they came to my address. <laughs> so it's not it little did I know. We bought a case of peeps. But little and do then, you like, know, they came later. to my address. I, yeah. I'm well aware of how many there was. Yeah, yeah and you know the box uh, on the peeps? Because they were like the little, um, like the bunnies. It wasn't It wasn't the... Uh, bunnies? The, yeah, they weren't the, the chicks. chickens. Yeah, they weren't yeah. the little chicks. They were the bunnies. bunnies. But it came oh, in the bunny, yeah. Bunnies, right. But it came in the box that said chocolate mousse. Like you were gonna get chocolate. Yeah, it's kind of disappointing peeps. when you think you're gonna yeah. get chocolate mousse. Yeah. I know. Peeps. You think you're gonna get chocolate, and, they were and like it's just like anti nope. banana yellow. Mhm. Mm they were like what? cherry foam mouth beer face yellow. Puke in the fucking bowl yellow. I wonder if some. Wonder if I you got somebody else's again. peeps. No. Could I be. got I got two boxes. They were addressed to me, both boxes, and Was I only there paid an, once. Do we have an invoice to prove that? I've I have. They an both invoice. had an invoice. Yeah. Oh wow. It's kind of like hey, it was a buy one get one free. Yeah. I was thinking I was going to get deal. 96. No coupon. Yeah, mm -hmm. but I got like 184. Yeah, see, no coupon. They just magically appeared. Yeah. See, some people don't do that. What are you doing? <laughs> Why would you do that? <laughs> Why would you do that? My foot, you already threw my sock. I was trying to it's gone. dampen the smell. It doesn't Aww. smell. Our so foot is like, ro it's like roasting. There's like, I smell. It's roses. I have a lighter. Mm -hmm. Why am, I, why am I smelling? Foot? It's like brisket. No, is it, it, why does your foot smell like brisket? Well, that's the bacon I had earlier. Oh, right. It's seeping through, don't you know? I'm a meditarian. Wow. <laughs> I know. Wow. It just does that. I'm just, you just, know. Wow. <laughs> so I've had uh, three Chipoyo burgers this week. Oh. Fun fact. Yeah, you've had, what, four Chipoyo burgers, I think, this week? Three this week. Three this week. I took one day off. Well, no, I, I took one day off, so I've had four Chipoyo burgers. We thoroughly believe in supporting local Portland food carts. Absolutely. The food yeah. carts here are outstanding. Yeah. Just like we believe in supporting Toys for Tots. Exactly. And mm -hmm. things that we support today by doing the PGX. The 30-hour day. Whatever we day. want to call it on 30-hour day. Yeah. Whatever we're calling our thing. Yeah. yeah. It doesn't That's matter what we're calling it. It's like I want to call it the PDX Sox, PDX After Hours. I think it's just like PDX Fabulous. <laughs> PDX Excellence. Yeah, that, that, that's it. Yeah, that's, that's it. Entirely. The X stands for Fabulous. It could have been a double X. Could have been triple? triple it X. could have been a triple X. Like a it titty could be. movie. Well, yes. if it were triple X, it would have made some money. Yeah. <laughs> Which what we're doing now is making money, which is awesome. <laughs> well, we hope it's making we're money. We're not making money. We're not making money. Hopefully, no, yeah, no. Hopefully, Hopefully people are like, oh my God. Well, I told you I was pocketing some money for a segue, but. You have enough of this. Well, you don't know that. No, I'm pretty sure that's why we kept the donation thing away from you. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah, true. It's, it's all through the interwebs. True. It has nothing to do with you. I'm not allowed. No, there's you're a, not allowed. There's I a paper trail. Yeah. There's mm -hmm. a paper trail. It's, it's not going to happen. I do have a mask and a, and a gun in the cards. You know, for what? So bad. Just rob a plant pantry. To rob room. the electrical bank. The electrical bank? <laughs> can, can I have? Can you wire <laughs> me the money, please? <laughs> rob the Segway factory? Yes. I will escape on my Segway. So is that what you really want for Christmas, Emily? I want. You know, I just I've come to terms that I will never receive a Segway in my life. But well, see, you're trying to do it all wrong. If I was to receive one gift that I would appreciate more than anything in my life. It would be a Segway. That's what I want. I want a Segway, and I want to put a little buggy on it. And I want to drive down the streets of Hawthorne and be like, hey, boo, want to ride my Segway? <laughs> you think I'm joking. I'm just dead serious about this. I want, I want a Segway. I want a boo in the side of my Segway, and I want to cruise the streets of Portland. A well, there you a go. Side, a sidecar? Yeah, I want a boo in my sidecar, and I want my Segway. All right. Well, Robert, what do you want for Christmas? Say what? What do you want for Christmas? I hadn't thought about it. You haven't thought about it? you got like nine days to think about it. 
Yeah, but this tonight isn't about what I want for Christmas. All right. Well, what what would you like others to have for Christmas? Whatever they'd like. Okay. We'd no, like I just, what I'd like for Christmas is everybody watching to donate a dollar. That would be awesome. Yeah. One I, don't, I don't need anything. Okay. Yeah, I just need everybody to donate a dollar. Do you right know, now. like, if they're like, if they're watching right now, how do they donate? Do they click on the button and go through There's like a, a card? There's a button okay. somewhere. I can point. Making credit card information. Like, how how does it go? Like, do you know the means that you need to donate? Yeah, it'll be a, a credit card, and you know, it'll yeah. be an immediate charge, and mm-hmm. you know, it's just like buying anything else online. What have you? What, what have, what's the most, what's the thing? And peeps, notwithstanding. Peeps aside. What, what have you bought online recently? What have I bought online? Yeah. iPhone apps. Okay, well, you Same feed deal. a credit card number in for iPhone apps. I buy Papa John's online. There you go. Yeah. So it's just like that. Yeah. Same deal. Instead cool. of a pizza, you're helping out the Oregon so food bank. So instead of order now, you hit donate here. Exactly. Yes. Nice. I was looking at it earlier. It's, it's a very jolly candy-like button. It's probably over here or over here. You just <laughs> click on it. Put in your put in your uh, credit card information or someone else's. In fact, kids, go in your mother's purse. Yes, <laughs> do. Get out the credit card. Amex, specifically if it's black, if it's an Amex black, get in there, donate as hard as you can. That's all I can say. Start donating early. Well, he's got a twenty. What, wait, what about Discover? What about Discover? Oh, Amex. Ooh. No, Discover. Discover card. Yeah. Some places don't take that. Yeah. Try it anyway. PayPal. Just do it anyway. Try yeah, it. Anyway. I mean, what could it hurt? Yeah. What could it really hurt? You could be making the difference between, you know, a kid getting some toys for Christmas or no. Or a family it's getting some food or not. a plain potato or a twice-baked potato here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's exactly. a good analogy, Emily. Yeah, yeah that's very no, good. I'm, I like I'm that. Positive the reinforcement, potato versus yeah. the twice-baked potato. Kid here? Sure. Yeah, I like that analogy a lot. With bacon on it, even. I was, well, in, yeah. uh, I was in North Portland today. I'm sorry. I, no, uh, Pope? Well, no, I had to go to the Salvation Army again for the Toys for Tots, but... Um, there was, and I can't remember the, the name of the bar, but on their on their uh, marquee it just said, beer, booze, and bacon, and I I didn't I, <laughs> I forget I forget what it was called, but it, it, I think it was on uh, Alberta Alberta I think I don't know I'm gonna go find it again. Well, you didn't take a picture of it though. No, I was driving. Oh, so I all right. I, Why would that stop you? When I was driving. Yeah. Like, well, I mean, you got to get that cell phone action in while you're driving pretty quick. But I'm because like, that's that's about to be rendered, you know, against the law. It's well, a ticket. you know, I'll get a Bluetooth, but um, you'll get a Bluetooth. I will. See, that whole thing confuses me because you see people now walk, you know, driving around with headsets on, and I was told growing up that you couldn't do that. You can't wear a headset in the car while you're driving. Well, I think it's I think those headsets are different because they are just one ear. Which headsets are those? The Bluetooth. The it's Bluetooth just is just one ear. Right, I know, but what if I prefer wired instead of Bluetooth? What if I can't afford a Bluetooth? Can I use a wired one? You mean with I a don't. boom and like? No. No, no, no. Well, one that like, would just like, like stick into your phone. phone. With a little white yeah. Stereo, but it's got a little mic in it. I don't think that would. I don't know if that would count because it's something. If you maybe had it in one ear, it might count. But I think if you had it in two, then you could like essentially get a ticket, because then who knows if you're actually on the phone or if you're listening to music to distract you. But it's not technically illegal in Oregon yet, just California, right? Coming After up. the first. Two, two weeks. Yeah, it's $90. $90 ticket? Yeah. $90 yeah. Ticket. yeah. I did a story about it today on Unibash Radio. Yeah. Dot com. <laughs> um, but the, the funny thing about that law is that if you're under 18, no use at all. You're not even allowed to have a Bluetooth. Right. So. Huh. See, hmm. I don't even read that stuff anymore because I'm well past that. <laughs> Past 18? Yeah. I figured, you know, Brian, he is too. Barely. I, that I don't know. <laughs> that I don't know. That's up to him. Yeah. That's up to him. All right. Do you have a Bluetooth? You Bluetooth? I have a Bluetooth uh, Xbox set. Here, smile. Let me see. <laughs> <laughs> Bluetooth. You already have one? I don't. Not yet. You're no. not ready? No. You? Well, I'm you not drive. ready. No, I'm not ready. You, you're not ready? You don't no, drive. I don't you drive, don't so I don't care. You they don't piss care. me off, though. People, like, go into public, and they have their Bluetooth on, and they're like, I would like two tacos and blah, 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 and I would like sour cream on those. It's like, can you just make your order and turn off your Bluetooth? See, it reminds me of that old, uh, that George Lucas movie. Star Wars? First, no, no, no. Older than that. Oh. That, uh, THX 1138. Oh, that, I haven't even seen that's, Star Wars. That's, that's like old. his first movie, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah, you see these people walking around with those really old first-generation Bluetooth headsets? 
It's like sitting there pulsating in their head. It's like well, it's like the old cellular phone. That thing was like a brick. Yeah. Yeah. You know, the sound system he created for theaters, named after that movie. Yeah. THX. Yeah. Huh. What you don't give it. Huh. Huh. Interesting. Uh-huh. Wow. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That's <laughs> pointless. I agree. Data that I'll never remember again. I concur. Hooray. <laughs> I think more, you know, obviously more people know what THX is in terms of sound than the movie. Well, have you seen the movie? T- oh yeah, it's like they're working on computers and. Oh, you know, something resembling computers. Was there cloning involved? No. Yeah, it's, just, it's just really. I remember them running through. T- was what star was in it? The Robert. Robert Duvall. The Robert Duvall, yes. Robert Wagner. Robert Wagner was, was not him. in. It was Robert <laughs> Wagner and Duvall. That movie. Yes. Robert. <laughs> Darth Wagner. Darth Wagner. <laughs> Darth Duvall. <laughs> The ball, Darth Wagner. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, my my microphone. I, w- I went to uh, go to the bacon, beer, and boobs thing, and I lost my clip. It's okay. in the couch somewhere, like my keys that I lost. All right, we're, we're coming up on a break in about Wonderful. a few minutes, so few uh, minutes, we'll, yeah. we'll figure we'll, my we'll situation. Just yeah, okay. we'll dig it. It's there. I just, you don't you need know. to get it any closer than that, though. You're fine. Okay. It's yeah, very good. good. Don't bring it up. Don't bring it up. No. Yeah. Don't bring it up. The world's smallest microphone. It is. It's like um. <laughs> I know what it. No, I'm not gonna say what no. I'm playing. <laughs> it's like that. Yeah. So it's it's like it was a word. No, it was a word that you were having a problem with a yeah. while ago. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. It is that word. Yeah. I missed the word. You you you'll remember the word here. You can in disclose minute. the word if when? you want to. Somebody's just gonna tell me the word. No, we'll we'll tell you the word later. Yeah. Oh, what's word? <laughs> yeah, it's a, a word that Emily has a problem with, and so that she's looking at it going. That's most words. Literally. Yeah. No, Literally. it's not. <laughs> what? Literally. Literally. I know that drives me crazy. She's like, literally. No, literally. it's literally. Like it <laughs> Is that really how I say it? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Give me like a sentence that the word lit. Li- li- literally. That word you say literally, literally. Literally. Okay. Literally, you say literally, literally. No, literally. I would literally say literally, literally as literally, but you would say it literally, literally. Literally. Because right. it's literally. It's like literature is literally, literally. Something, you know, you're right. Well, I think linguistically you've got problems because you've spent time growing up in both Atlanta and St. Louis, right? It's because I've read so many books. I'm sure that's <laughs> it. Oh, yeah, I'm sure I'm that's sure it. That's the problem. What was the last book you read? I haven't. I've what was never the last read, book you read? I've never read a full book. Uh, the last book I read was um, by uh, an author named Hyacin. He's out of Miami. Nature Girl by, uh, by Mr. Hyacin. Very Nature good book. Nature Girl? Yes. Hmm. Starts off with the, uh, an Indian dumping a body in the swamps of Florida. Very interesting. Wow. Yeah. Did Chuck Palahniuk write that? No, he did not. Oh. No. He's, ri- <laughs> he's written everything else, though, apparently. Yeah. Okay. 99% of all other books he's written. Literally. Across the Oregon. Literally. Literally. Yeah. Hey. And no literally. Yeah. What was the name of Chelsea King? <laughs> what if it was literal literally? Literally literature. Literal literally. Literally literature. Literally literature. Yes. Jesus. Can we tell them the secret about the fun game on Twitter yet? No, not yet. Okay. When you take out your trash, do you do, do, you do it literally? literally? No, literally. literally. I literally take out literally. the trash. <laughs> Is that really the incorrect way to say the word? Literally. If it's the incorrect way, you can just tell me now and I will stop saying it, like literally. Well, the way you say it, you, it's spelled L-I-T-R-A-L-L-Y. Literally. Okay. That's how you pronounce it. Yeah. It's an apostrophe. Phonetically. And it's supposed to be said literally. literally. Liter- like there's a D, like a lid, like a lid you literally. wear on your head. Like literally. No, the D is silent. It's more the E. It's literally. The Q is silent. But I'm saying it by the textbook's way right, right? Literally. No, you're just saying it too fast. You're putting the emphasis on the wrong syllable. Lit- yeah, literally. it's like you're, you're taking out a couple of the vowels and you're saying literally instead of literally. It's like all you right. don't care about the vowels at all. Well, I feel like somebody just stole my, my little pony. <laughs> Maybe they did. Literally. <laughs> Literally. They did. Good. Literally. Wow, it's like a support group for people that can't yeah. pronounce it's words. A phonetic <laughs> it's a phonetic support group. English is not my first language. What is oh, Canadian? Georgia? You know what? You Georgian? know what we just became? A Marinish. We became hooked on phonics. We did. Yes, we did. And it or worked for me. easy to learn Spanish. C. C. Can I tell you a phrase in Spanish? Do it. Sure. We have people in South America listening. Me gusta. Watching. A la panocha. <laughs> Which means? I like your pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Me gusta a la panocha. Gato. Did you just, did you just tell, did you teach her that? Gato, great. Gato. 
No. And you know what else? I got. You want to hear a little story real quick? You got a second? Is it Spanish? Before we got it, it's in hours. German. It's a 30-hour day after all. I went to a German class and I uh, went to the dictionary and the first word I found in there was the uck word, and it's ficken in Germany. And I went to my teacher and I said ficken do. <laughs> I got in trouble. You said what? Ficken do. Ficken do means uck you. Oh. Yeah, in German. You've already swore. What? You, you've broken the seal. Does it mean? I know. I feel bad now because tots want toys. There is no swear, Hein, and you've already broken it. <laughs> tots want toys. <laughs> tots want toys, and you, you've already sworn. <laughs> Ficken do. It's fine because it's in German. Nobody knows. You know it's like 9 a.m. in Germany right now? No, that's what it's later than it's Fick probably and do. 11 a.m. It's 9 a.m. Do. do you know where Germany is? No. It's uh, no. on a It's map? in Europe. How, okay, raise your hand if you could find Germany on a map. Really? Yeah. Literally? I've been to like three cities in Germany. Which ones? Uh, it can do. Nuremberg, Munich, and uh, something else. Fick and do. Fick and do. Hamburg? No. Berlin? No. I'm, I'm out. Rotterdam? It's, it's between Nuremberg that's, that's and Munich. Germany. Rotterdam? That's not in Germany. Isn't that no. Hillary Clinton's middle name? <laughs> <laughs> Hillary Rotterdam Clinton. <laughs> Secretary of State. Thanks, Obama. Yeah, so I think we are just about ready to pitch it back over. To Holy Burnham. God. What? Why would you do that? Do what? Because it's getting warm. I want to get rid of it. So I don't I even want this one now. Yeah, mine's getting a little warm. And, uh, this we, is the last one. So are we throwing it over, as they say? I think we are throwing it back over in just a few seconds here. And, um, and if it can do. Okay. Yeah. We're getting freaking, the, uh, we're getting the so they either want us to uh, stretch it out it. or start weaving a Make it Can longer. we tell them the secret of Twitter yet, please? Next, next break. No, next, next break. break. Next, next break. break. All right, the secret of Twitter is coming up in the next break. See, that's a tease. You've done very well, young Jedi. Literally. Now don't She hasn't even seen Star Wars. Are you kidding me? Dude, why would you ever want to watch Star Wars? Sorry, Dude, Portland. if Corton Fatboy 